Well, I'm um, kicking goals. I've been obsessing, haven't slept. I tried to, but uh, ended up inventing a new coil design in my head. <laughs> and uh, going, all right, bugger it, get up and do it. So, uh, yes, uh, basically my new coil design, I, I can do it either on a uh, conical arrangement or a, um, on a uh, toroid. And uh, the idea behind it is that it actually uh, takes advantage of what would be the um, back EMF that would become like, you know, let's say uh, displacement currents, you know, what do you call it, common mode currents, and it reintroduces them into the forward um, <laughs> signal into the system. <laughs> Recycling. And, uh, and uh, yeah, so, but... You can see how hot this system is, and I'll explain a little more. I am on the IC705 here, QRP. Sorry, I've got to get that to try and focus. It's a terrible camera. There we go. QRP, 5 watts. And um, I'm really going to have to stop obsessing soon and actually tidy the house up. It's a terrible mess. But yeah, this is a lot of energy coming off, and uh, that's just mad. And this system, I'm not even touching the conductive part. So this is just picking it up without having to run through to my body. So that is just insane. Um, but yeah, someone made a comment recently on one of my old videos, and it sort of reminded me that there was something I should have really been continuing with. So what I'm working on here is, I'm just feeling it out. It's all very dodgy at the moment. But as you can see, there's two elements. I've basically separated two parts of what was a... Uh, a TV log periodic um, just as my electrodes and uh, I'm running them differentially so these are 180 degrees out of phase and um, the reason I've got them pitched like that is my idea is that that will encourage more of the electric fields to interact across that path and my thoughts are that behind the system so that it will be a beam it won't be pointing up like that but behind the system to have like a, a loop, a closed loop um, that makes it very difficult to drive currents. And if it, currents get driven, because it's a loop, uh, they're getting driven that way and behind it the, uh, the other way. So that would then cancel an effective TEM wave out the back. And But it, because the displacement currents we're running th across this section, not along like we imagine, mistakenly about antennas but the displacement currents through the air here will create the rotating magnetic fields which will create the TM wave so all going well then I'll have a actual small um, beam antenna for HF uh, if you just imagine like a plasma filament streaming across uh, at radio frequency but, uh, so there you go that's the idea and uh, but I'm really impressed with the uh, energy state <laughs> how's that for extreme qrp <laughs> seven three and thanks for watching i'm mad